Oh, Kazar, everybody, how are you doing? Welcome to another Fallout build, which, by the way, this entire month is dedicated to Wastelanders. So, buckle up. And before you buckle up, please make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on the bell notification. I know it's annoying, but I must do it now before I am professional. Yes. <laughs> However, I wanted to build something that was somewhat lore-friendly in the Fallout universe and would fit in with the DLC that is about to drop and there was one thing that came to mind now if we travel back in time yet forward in time in game uh, This is the gr uh, the grub and gulp now. You don't obviously get to see much of it It's basically a shack a Brahmin pen and three trading areas plus a little sitting area um, I tried to recreate this here with the i-59 pit stop now this is also kind of loosely based on um What's it called now? The I-88 from New Vegas. Uh, I think it's called the I-88, which is where you pick up Veronica. Uh, I don't have New Vegas, or else I would have been able to get better visuals to show you. But the I-59 pit stop is a small area dedicated to, like, giving people who are on a big caravan journey. So, like, lugging a bunch of stuff across the wastes. Uh, just a place to, like, put the feet up, get some food for the Brahmin. Uh, maybe restock up on some water or some food because I have food here. Sadly, my moot fruit tree was destroyed. Uh, and of course, as I like to do, check the map. That little map that I showed off a minute ago. Um, damn, I love that. Now, when I was building this, I had a choice. I could either go over the top and, you know, do like a Fallout New Vegas. Uh, sorry, do a uh, Fallout 76 build, or I could go barren and bland. And do a Fallout New Vegas build. Now, if you don't know why I said barren and bland, uh, a lot of the stuff in New Vegas is quite barren and bland. Uh, that's that's basically it. It's it's got like the weirdest decorations, the sparsest decorations, and the reason that there is only one crafting bench here is because in New Vegas you only have one crafting bench that does all the crafting. Admittedly, this only does you know weapons and stuff, and that's just it's a, it's a shame that. Some of the stuff that is in New Vegas looks far better than some of the stuff we have. But I thought that this build would just be a nice little way to kick off Wastelanders Month. Uh, it's a stupid build. It's, it, trust me, it is a stupid build. But it's fun. It gives me a little bit of like role-playing opportunities. People have walked past already uh, and traded with me and you know rested up. And Gram was here. Gram walked past. Gram is now working, by the way. I discovered that Gram is now working and you can you know go trade with him again. So, there you go. Not only do we kick off Wastelanders, but we also bring hope back into <laughs> Appalachia with the fact that Gram now works. So go check him out. Uh... But until then, ladies and gentlemen, you know the drill. Like, share, and subscribe. And until the next time, stay awesome.